Thank you guys, and that's right. I mean, Julia, she might have had the food, the drinks, the sunshine, but I have Eminem and Khalid. That means I'm winning on day three of Boston Calling. The sun might not be shining, but the scene, I'll tell you one thing, that is on fire. Let's go enjoy some music at Boston Calling 2018. Who's been to Boston Calling before? Raise your hand up. So what did you love about last year? Chance the Rapper. I'm going to marry him one day. Just so he knows, we're going to be together. It's going to happen. Just wait for me. I promise I'll be there for you. Love found right here, Dirty Water Media. We're, we're finding love today. What made you want to come back for a second round of Boston Calling? Taylor Bennett, Chance the Rapper's little brother. <laughs> it's a family thing, the family affair. I just want to be my brother-in-law. <laughs> All right, hang around now, the Miller Lite tent. First off, the best thing I saw so far with this tent is they have a full charging station. I found you guys like plugging our phones in. I mean, that's needed in a festival. So what are you guys most excited for at the festival this year? Eminem. Eminem? Eminem, 100%. Have you ever been to Boston before? I haven't. It's your first time. How about you? First time. How's your first timers? Super easy to get here, super easy to go home, having fun with everybody. My phone's charged, Miller Lite tent. I have a drink in my hand. Life's pretty good in Boston. It's pretty amazing that a festival like this has something for everywhere from bands to rappers to hip-hop. What's the number one act that you're most excited for all weekend long? I'll be honest, I was originally Eminem, but I think Khalid's going to be a lot of fun. Khalid's one of the best performers I've ever seen live. He's actually a young kid, yeah. but he's all been having a good time. Billboard's number one right now. Dude, that guy's on every song, like, overnight. Uh, it's Mike E.V. hanging right now with Chris from Field Report. First off, I appreciate you bringing all the cold weather on your, on your day. Yeah, dude, it just follows me around. We're from the Midwest, here we are. Legit, it was, it was beautiful all weekend. I mean, at least it's not snowing, but it was like 80. We took a 50-degree swing when Chris got to town. He was like, <laughs> Minnesota, Milwaukee's coming to Boston, all cold weather. Yeah, dude, sorry. I think it is going to snow now. It feels like snow's coming. <laughs> so for you guys playing a festival, what, what's your favorite part about it? Well, it's, what's cool is that uh, we're not the only thing bringing an audience here, you know, and, and so there's going to be a lot of people that have no idea who we are, but they will have seen us and then they'll come see us again. And it's cool to, to hear from people like, oh, we saw you at such and such a festival like years ago and that's why we're here. So it's just a great opportunity to get in front of a bunch of different people and try to make connections one at a time. And that's a wrap. Another Boston Calling in the books. And this year was the best yet. What an amazing way to kick off the concert season. Reporting for Dirty Water Media, my name is Mikey V.